We do have a diverse list of names. There you go. You can see some of them on the board there. Um, Qualcomm stocks down huge from its 52 week high. And maybe that's part of the premise here from some the way they're thinking. Netflix down 73. Uh, that's quite interesting. Jason, you bought more net. Uh, I'm sorry. You bought more Qualcomm after its earnings. I did. You know, so obviously, I mean, Qualcomm is, has done a great job diversifying away from the handset game, handset game and is, is in autos now. They, you know, the licensing business, obviously litigation is behind them and they're trading at 11 times forward. And they really had a strong print uh, last week. EPS growth beat on revenue and strong guidance in this type of environment. So I like Qualcomm here. I think it's it's reasonably priced, strong valuation. So I think there's an opportunity. Joe Palo Alto on the list. Yep, struggling today, that's for sure, uh, along with some other cyber names like uh, Fortinet. But I'll stay with Palo Alto here. Um, I like the market share that they've been able to attain over the last several quarters. That's been reflected in what has been strong earnings, a reasonable valuation relative to the others. I understand that it's that valuation seems a little bit high to a lot of areas of technology, but I like Palo Alto. It's a longer term play uh, and I'm happy to own it. Here. United HealthWise. Now, I know we talked healthcare, but that was uh, one of the picks on, on the on the on the list, the top of the list. Look, the, the company executes flawlessly. They're, they're the gorilla in the space. They can drive pricing. Um, I mean, they're everywhere. Why wouldn't you want to own it? It's not cheap, but it shouldn't be cheap. So, yeah, you know, look, uh, I got to buy it at some point. Just have to. Yeah, Valero, Joe, 52 week high, speaks to the energy trade right here. Yep, yep. gasoline in particular, driving season. Uh, I'm pretty sure this is a, a favorite name of our good friend, Mark Fisher. I think there's a lot more upside to come in uh, VLO. I also heard Guy Adami talking about it on the. Uh, five o'clock show as well. I'd stay in the name. Okay.